Today we are going to be looking at 12 brand new hidden rewards, secrets, and easter eggs here in the Fortnite Chapter 3 Season 2 update that you guys might have missed. And to start things off, we're going to be looking at the brand new bosses added to the Fortnite Season 2 map, which have returned with brand new mythic weapons. The first one is Dr. Sloan, who is located over at the Fortress POI, which is a brand new point of interest featured in the Chapter 3 trailer, where the massive drill causing all of the earthquakes last season has finally arisen from underneath the ground bringing a new area of the map where Dr. Sloan is located with some IO guards where she will also drop her mythic burst rifle which is an absolute god gun this season. And the second boss is actually a brand new one that we've never seen in game before. It is a boss known as Huntmaster who is actually very very difficult to kill. He's definitely harder to take out than Dr. Sloan so you want to make sure you roll up on this guy with a squad because he can teleport around so whether or not you're building or in cover he can literally just teleport behind you which is pretty OP. He is located over at Command Cavern, which is the brand new POI that took over uh, Covert Canyon from last season, and he also drops a Mythic Thermal AR, which is a brand new weapon that they unvaulted and brought back into the Season 2 loot pool this season. Now, something else that's also going to be returning, and I know all of you OG fans of Fortnite are going to be very, very excited, is the OG Pump Shotgun with a revamped version of the shotgun itself. It was actually leaked in the Vertical Zipline trailer featured over on the Fortnite YouTube channel, and for a brief second, Second, they try to slip in there that the skin in the trailer is actually using an unreleased shotgun that looks very familiar to the OG pump. Now, of course, there is probably going to be slight design changes, but the overall damage, sound effects, and usage of the weapon is going to be very similar. And considering it was seen in this trailer, it should be unvaulted and added into the loot pool sometime throughout this season, most likely in the first big downtime update we get in the next few weeks. Now, the next Easter egg here is actually a secret map update that I feel like a lot of people overlooked, but if you guys are OG players from back in chapter one of Fortnite, this is probably going to be very exciting and very good news for you if you actually head on over to the north side outside of Condo Canyon you guys will see out in the dust that there is a few different jagged weirdly shaped rocks reaching out of the dirt and if you actually take a very close look at this this is actually the rock family underneath the sand that was in Fortnite and had a little mini storyline going on back during the early days of chapter one, which every single update, Fortnite would update these and change their location. And there was literally a whole storyline of these rocks that ended up having kids and starting a family. And it was a really, really cool little Easter egg that was going on in the background that it looks like they might be bringing back. As we get future updates throughout season two, the sand might slowly start to erode away and the rock family might make a triumphant return to the Fortnite Island, which I think would be awesome, and it's a pretty cool nod to Chapter 1. And we send a gift to a lucky subscriber in every single video here on the channel. So if you want to receive a gift in a future video, make sure you guys drop a like, subscribe to the channel with notifications turned on, and also leave your epic usernames down below so I can add some of you and send you gifts. Also going to be sending a ton of battle passes as well, so make sure you guys follow all the steps so you can be entered in to get one. And for the next two secrets, we actually have some brand new weapons returning, being unvaulted here in the Fortnite Season 2 loot pool that we have not seen in a while. The first item here is the airstrike, which was only in the game for a very short period of time. There's actually a lot of you guys that play Fortnite currently that have probably never even gotten to use this item, but it's uh, pretty self-explanatory. It was literally a grenade type item where you threw it wherever the grenade signal flared, there would be a massive airstrike that barraged that area around it, which is really, really good when you are in an intense build fight with someone that's boxing up. And data miners were also able to go into the Fortnite season two files once the update went live and they actually found a brand new rocket launcher that's going to be coming into season two known as the anvil rocket launcher this thing is absolutely amazing with the addition of tanks and a bunch of other vehicles coming out in the game which we're going to be talking about later in the video there is really no good way to counter them except this brand new anvil rocket launcher which is very similar to a javelin if you guys have ever seen that you lock onto a certain area or vehicle so the tanks most likely is going to be what you're using this for and it'll shoot the rocket straight up in the air and then barrage down on the area that you locked onto, causing mass amounts of damage. So it's a lot different than the typical rocket launcher and RPG we've seen in Fortnite, but I'm very excited for it to get added to the game with all these vehicles in the season. Now, data miners also went in the files and found that another fan favorite vehicle will be returning sometime during the season, and that is the Choppas, and they also have a revised and revamped look to them that is actually designed to be 
themed around the seven. So in the trailer that we saw in chapter three, it obviously has the imagined order with all of their vehicles and army against the seven. The Chapas are obviously going to be on the seven side, which is awesome. They're finally going to be making a return after not being in the game for almost a whole nine seasons. And with the seven getting Chapas returning to fight with their army, we also saw in the chapter three trailer, if you guys looked in the background, there's a lot of information that uh, gave away what's going to be coming out throughout the season. But the Storm Wings airplanes are are also going to be making a return sometime throughout season two and they are actually going to be owned and themed around the imagined order now we don't know if the planes are going to be designed different or the damages and statistics of them are going to be similar to back when they were added in the original season of chapter one season seven but they are going to be making a return as seen in the trailer and i am very excited for that because it seems like there's going to be a lot of vehicles that is great for mobility and with choppas and airplanes returning there should be some cool fights happening in the sky which I think is epic. Another feature that we've never seen before here in Fortnite that's also going to be added later this season was also seen in the Chapter 3 Season 2 story trailer when it was revealed that there is going to be drivable battle buses coming in a future update. In the Chapter 3 Season 2 trailer, you could literally see members of the Seven driving the battle bus into battle against the IO, and this makes me think, along with the new and redesigned battle bus that we have currently flying over the Fortnite island every single game, that there is going to be battle bus type vehicles added to the game that we're able to drive they can probably fit a lot more people in it than the regular cars here in Fortnite, and they're probably going to have a lot more health than normal which is going to be great for rotating getting around the map and just taking a bunch of damage and for the next secret easter egg here it's actually coming from donald mustard's twitter himself who is the creative director and overall leader of what happens here in Fortnite battle royale he's the genius behind everything we know and love he actually tweeted out when we fall asleep where do we go with a picture picture of him at a Billie Eilish concert. If you guys are not Billie Eilish fans, that is actually a lyric and a title of one of her more popular songs as well, which foreshadows and gives us information that the next icon skin and collaboration happening in season two is most likely going to be a Billie Eilish skin, which a lot of people have been wanting for a very long time. She's a very popular artist. She has been very, very relevant, and she also has just really good overall family-friendly music that would fit perfectly in Fortnite, which is kind of what they look for with all the other artists and icon series skins we've seen in the game. There is also a possibility that if the Billie Eilish collab does end up happening, there also could be a Billie Eilish live event and concert, which would be very, very exciting. I feel like the icon series collaborations that have live events and concerts usually get people a lot more hyped and excited, and uh, starting season two off with a concert would be absolutely amazing. And for the final Easter egg and secret of this video, it's information coming from the data miner known as Hypex, who is very reliable, but he tweeted out saying, new upcoming vehicle, in quotes, Baller V2, the code name in the files is Hamster Ball Prototype, and and it actually has 400 health. So the ballers could be making a return here in Fortnite, which similar to some of the other vehicles we talked about in the video have not been in the game for a very, very long time. He, and he actually described it as the ballers V2. So on top of having a lot more health and on top of having 400 health, which is a lot more than the original ballers that were added in game, there could be some different features or mechanics of how these things are going to be working if they are revising them to make them a baller V2 version in quote. And as of right now, that is all of these secret Easter eggs, leaks, informations for all these secret things happening behind the scenes here in chapter three season two if you guys enjoyed the video and want to see more like this make sure to drop a like on the video subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new i really appreciate the support we're going to be daily uploading videos here on youtube for all season two content and you guys are definitely not going to want to miss it thanks for watching i'll catch you guys in the next one take it easy my friends